Hi, it's Barton Jennings here. Thank you for asking me to have a look at this CT scan. Uh, this lady has history of metastatic cholera, took cancer and there are metastases in the lung and the question is can bronchoscopic biopsy access these lesions for tissue for clinical trials? And you can see there's a nodule here in the left upper lobe, looks like a metastasis which will be difficult to access. Here's a nodule here in the right lower lobe apical segment. Just here is an airway leading to that lesion which would suggest that this lesion would be amenable to biopsy bronchoscopically but would require radiolebus. The main mass here in the lateral right lower lobe is probably the easiest to target but the bronchoscope is likely to see to about here so I suspect there will be no endobronchial lesion visible so radiolebus will be required to help target this lesion. There's also a lesion here anteriorly in the right middle lobe. Once again there's an airway just here leading to that lesion so this and that airway leads straight into it so that would be amenable to radiolebus. On the left there's a left hyalur lesion this is better seen in the mediastinal windows. If we just scroll down through the mediastinal windows, you can see the left hyalur lesion in here. Now this is a difficult area to access. We won't be able to access it with a linear EBUS scope because that can only reach to about here. So it'll be beyond the linear scope. There's not really an airway leading into it. So I don't think that that would be amenable to radial EBUS either. And it may actually be a lymph node I suspect lymph node metastasis there. So I think that some of these lesions would be amenable to bronchoscopic biopsy and would require radiolebus to help guide sampling and if they were able to be accessed on the radial probe then core biopsies would be possible. Okay hopefully that's helpful.